Obviously, from working with all of those athletes, the thousands of athletes who have been injured over time, I have learned a ton. But yet, I, I find I have no answers. Yeah. In a sense, I, I have observations, and those observations do shed some light on the issues of, of the mental, emotional, and, and psychological components of, of injury, all the way from the prevention of injury to the coping with them and the actual treatment of injury. Uh, not only physiologically, but uh, psychologically as, as well. We should all know that there are, there are two kinds of athletes, really. Uh, there are athletes who get injured, and there are those who will. So it's not something we can totally prevent as such, but we can absolutely have an influence uh, and control the frequency in which injury does take place. In a few moments, we're gonna be joined by a group of professionals, people who in their own field are experts, who have a lot to say about injury when it comes to athletes. There'll be trainers and coaches here, and what we'll do is we'll rely on them to ask the right questions and also to answer those questions and give their expertise and input along with my take on what those questions are all about. It seems like more and more athletes sustain a severe injury every, each year. Um, I just wonder if there anything can be done to reverse that trend. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I see a lot of things. Uh, that we can do, and I was just curious as to any of you have an idea what you've worked with, Mark? What yeah, I think there's a lot of factors that go into injury rates. You know, um, the conditioning levels of the athlete, their physical capabilities, practice planning, um, their preparation for the contest or the practice or whatever. So there's a lot of a lot of things that can be addressed, including mental aspects of whether they're ready to pre prepare to participate or play mm -hmm. or run or whatever the case mm -hmm. may be. I guess that's where some of my work would come in, huh? Yeah, absolutely. Have you worked with psychologists before yeah. in terms of this, and what kind of things do they do? Um, it, usually, it, with our kids that I've dealt with in the past over 20 years, it's more the kids that are struggling beyond the normal day-to-day -day struggles that mm -hmm. they'll go see the psychologist, and many times it's affecting their performance. Mm -hmm.